Well, 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 hello everybody. Welcome to Riptide Resurgence. This is an upcoming uh, FE2 fan game that l recently they're like doing a global playtest, kind of like how they do it in Splatoon, where everybody can play the game. Everybody can play the game for a few days, and then after that, the game will close again. So I'm going to be playing it today and seeing if it's good. I've been pretty hype about this game. Right now, the animations look clean. Like, everything looks exactly like FE2. They got a bunch of maps. Like, this game has a lot of maps. I think they already have almost as many maps as Flood Escape 2 has. Uh, there's weapons, because there is a uh, fighting game mode. You can slide under here. What's my slide button? Uh, what's my slide keybind? It's Q. Why is it Q? Ew. Should be E. Q is E mode. Surface space, the dive left sh left shift. No, that should be E. Same as my sliding key. Okay, there we go. So yeah, this game has a uh, weapons, which I think is pretty cool. They like have a, they have like an arena game mode where you just fight other people. But I'm only gonna play. I'm gonna play standard. I'm only gonna play the regular mode today. I'm not gonna be playing the fighting modes because I don't like the fighting modes. I mean, I do like the fighting idea, but I'd rather you know play actual flood escape and not the arena game modes. But yeah, it's pretty cool that this game is a. It's it's gonna be really nice. I, I just have really high hopes for this game. All right, let's vote. Uh, May and Remnants is a pretty good map. I remember that. So if you're a C, it's all right. Nothing special. Wow, this controls exactly like FE2. I love it. It's so clean. All right, here we go. Yeah, this is just May and Remnants. You remember this was a a highlight not a, a, a little bit ago, I think. I don't remember when it was a highlight. I think it was like two or two months ago, maybe? I don't know. But it was a good highlight. I kind of wish it stayed. I wish Crazy Blocks added more permanent maps. Because if anything, I think this game's going to outdo Flood Escape 2 when it comes to permanent maps. Because they've been adding a lot, and the game's not even out yet, so. Yeah, this game is just super good, honestly. They're, they've been doing a great job. The physics do feel a little floatier. How did you die? How did someone die? Oh, there's a kill feed for the arena game mode as well. I think they should separate the feed in between the game modes. Because right now I think there's an arena match going on, and you can see the feed up here. Yeah, I'm here for the uh, flood escape part, not the uh, arena part. The arena part is really cool though. I will give that a try eventually, maybe, when the game releases. But right now I'm here for, uh, I'm here for the flood escape maps. So yeah. You did, this game is just really good. Alright, we beat it. We win. Nice. How do I have a best time? I have never played this game. <laughs> How do I have a best time? I never played it. How hard was the map? I, just, I mean, I think 2.4 is correct. Yeah, this game's just good. Alright, challenging. Uh, jungle. Oh, Sapphire Falls. They got Sapphire Falls? Yes, please. Sapphire Falls is a banger. A banger map. Never back it down. Never give up. What? I can't with a Nick A30 emote, dude. <laughs> so funny. Alright, we got Sapphire Falls by RE Max. This is a banger map. Also, a little neat thing about buttons Never in this game is uh, they have a little Never effect. They have a little lines on the parts they activate, like that. I really, really like that. That's a very good feature for sight readers. That's like actually amazing. Give me that. Yeah, I got a button. Let's go. My button. Look at that. I love these little lines. These This little effect is really cool. No, gotta go here. Alright, you can just mate dash on, right? I think you can. I just forgot that you can. I, I, I forgot how to play this map. It's been a while. It's been a while. But yeah, I really love all the effects this map, this game has. And it releases December this year, so it's not that far away. And I definitely will be playing it a lot when it comes out. This is generally probably the best Flood Escape fan game. I kind of wish it already released. Like, this game is in a playable state. I feel like it should just be released with more content coming, you know? Why make us wait till December when the game is in a playable state, you know? But, I mean, I understand. They don't want to rush it. I completely understand. I just kind of wish they just gave us the game, like, already. <laughs> Even though, because, like, it's like a playtest, but the game is already so polished. It's like crazy good. Come on, trust. Activate. Yeah, there we go. We win. We beat the Sapphire Falls. Let's go. 
I'd say Sapphire Falls like a 3.7. It's not a 3.5. Well, I mean, 3.5 is okay. I think 3.7 is better because the, the pace of that is actually pretty fast. Skywork Falls! Yo, this game's got all the good maps. Oh, they got Wrecked Wasteland. That's a good map. I like that map. That's a pretty good map. Yeah. All right, let's go. It's dark. We got a blackout. FNAF! Five Nights Freddy! Bruh. I should put my emo key to F. I don't know why it's Q. I usually use F. I don't know why I set it to Q. I'm gonna be real with you. I honestly think this is better than Flood Escape 2. Like, already? This is, like, amazing. This game is just so good. I'm in love with this game. And I hope that the release of this game goes well, because this it's just so well made. Like, genuinely, like, it's just really good. Like, I could play this for hours and just never get bored. Well, maybe not hours. I get bored of any game that I play for that long, but yeah. This game is just... Perfect. It's perfection. <laughs> There's not much else I can say to it. It's, it's got some really cool ideas. It's got some amazing ideas, and it's just... I want it to release faster, you know? I'm excited. I'm impatient. I got the button, nice. Oh, there's a little kick animation. Guys, get the button. There's a little kick animation, I like that. Wow, these are some tough jumps. I don't remember Skyrim Falls having these jumps. I mean, that's just me. Yeah, they definitely changed the ending a little bit. Not much, but... Yeah. Nice! Hell yeah, we beat Skyward Falls. Very cool. It's a very good map. I, did, I do wish it stayed. I think it was like a 4.6. Oh, we got a crazy or an extreme, as this game calls them. Beach City. Isn't that map in uh, Liquid Breakout? Dust Bowl Bazaar. How is Dust Bowl Bazaar a 5.0? That map is so hard. It's like 5.9 or 5.8. That map is so hard, unless they nerfed it? Maybe they did. I do not know how to play this map. I've seen this map in the Liquid Breakout, but I do not know how to play it. I have no idea how to play this map. I, I, I've i like I've played it like I've played this map maybe like once in like or twice in Liquid Breakout. And I just did not know what where to go. Oh fuck, I fell. That's bad. I think I have to get up too. Yeah, I'm dead, no way. I have no idea what to do on this map. <sighs> Respawn. Also, I like that this game has this voting system. Three maps get picked to put in the voting. That's how it should be. You get three maps to vote on. That's it. I don't like how FE2 gives you like eight maps. And you can like pay coins to unlock. I do not like that. Because that's too much option. Just picking three random maps out of the maps you have in the game, that's better. That's how you should do. That's how you should do it. This game knows how to do a voting system right. Do never give too much option or else people are gonna be voting all over the place and it's gonna be like, what's the point of voting? You get me? Like, I like this game's voting system more. It's a problem with the main FE2 and a lot of FE2 fan games is that they put too many options in the voting. Also, I think group ones are capped at three in this game instead of two, which is interesting. Oh wow, really? You can die like that? That sucks. That is a really bad way to die. <laughs> Bruh. I guess you got all these. Wait, what? Why are these question marks? Oh, mystery map vote. Oh, that's so interesting. I like that. I'm gonna steal that idea and put it in my own game. Mystery vote. That's actually really cool. Snowy Stronghold, yo! Wow, that's interesting. So, mystery vote. You don't know what the maps are. That's a cool, that's a cool idea. I like that. This map is so good. Oh, yo, they got a cinematic bar, so that's sick. They got that, I'm not editing that in, that's just in the game. I didn't edit that, that's just in the game. I love that. Is it me or is the lava really slow? Someone get the button, please. Oh, we're fucked. Oh, it's so over. It's so over. Bruh. It's so Jover. There's no way we beat this now, we were so late. Now it's night! Oh, that's so cool! That's so nice! I love this! Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> nice. No, Snowy Stronghold is not bad. We're bad. What is this? Three events! Toxic map, exploding buttons, and rescued this guy. Me when Toxic Woods OST. There's three events at once, dude, what the fuck? 
I got the rescue. Still gotta watch out for exploding buttons and whatever a toxic map means. I don't know what that does other than make it green. I, I do not know what toxic map does. Oh wow, are you serious? Bruh. I'm so bad, dude. Why am I so bad? Challenging. Club Quarry. Wait, Onama Views. Onama Views has like awesome music. I love Onama Views. It's so good. I'm voting that map just for the music. Onama Views is awesome. It's got like one of the best OSTs in Flood Escape history. For rating this game, 0 out of 2 Chris Semblers. Yes! Yes! This music is so good! They got the OST in. I love this. This is so good. This will forever be my one of my favorite Flood Escape OSTs. I love this so much. This game makes me happy, dude. This is like... What the fuck? <laughs> Nick830 jumps here. Oh, I want the SKP. Give me that. Oh, it uses a highlight in this game instead of a little billboard UI. Nice. Interesting. That's bad for mobile players, though, because mobile players can't see highlight outlines, which I think is stupid. Roblox, please fix. Whoa, look, it turned night. Did it turn? Is it mirror? Did it just turn night? Dude, that's cool. It made on all my views even better. Can't believe it. This is so good. I have nothing negative to say about this game. Like, everything about this game is amazing. It's, oh my god. I can't wait for this to be out, like, officially. I just can't wait. Please, we have to wait till December for the official release, and that makes me sad. I don't want to wait until all the way until December, dude. I mean, that's not too long. It's like... Four months? Yeah, it's not that bad. But yeah, we gotta wait. Boink. Nice! We win these. We win these! Yeah, never back down, never give up. Yeah, yeah. I should add these mystery votes to my game. I think that'd be a cool idea. Just have a rant. Sometimes the map vote is a mystery. Ooh, Flood Race! Flood Race. Yes. This is a good map. This is one of my favorite maps from Liquid Breakout. I already got the button. That jump is really hard for an insane though. Like this map is in my opinion peak, ins peak insane. It's pretty hard. And it's also a little confusing but it's super good. Like, where do you go here? You go here, I forgot. I forget. I never know if that's like the intended route there, but yeah, you can wrap there and you go. I do like flight escape maps that use wraparounds, although I think wraparounds should only be crazier and higher. I like the music on this map too. It's really good. The lava is coming. Okay, well I don't need to go get that button. Open sesame. I will forever love the little feature where buttons have a little indicator to which blocks they just activated. See, that's so cool! Wow, did I forget how intense this map actually is? Like, wow, the lava's fast. It's fast and the gameplay's hard, so... It's rough. There we go. Got you. Oh, we're dead. Oh, damn. That was awful. <laughs> Jungle Explorer. Oh, wait. Oil Outpost. Oil Outpost. Oil Outpost. Oil Outpost. Love this map. We'll always love this map. I think this is one of the... One of, if not the best map in Flood Escape history. And I'm very sad that it didn't make it in because of some weird controversy with one of the guys being annoying. One of the guys being an asshole, I guess. Alright. Nice. My hair is in my way face this will this is truly an oil outpost moment i love the the like all the little effects on this map i think they're really cool like look at that that's awesome and this too this this is also cool i love this i like this song so much i think it's the first time england got a, a no sd in the game too so congrats for that the map should have been permanent i'm it's sad that it wasn't it really should have been 
Alright, got the zipline. I almost missed it. That was that would have been bad. But you got that. I'm just gonna head up and win these. Hell yeah. Helicopter, helicopter. We win! Let's go. This game would be the best thing if it had force facilities, so true. Wasn't that cancelled? I'm oh okay, I'm dead. There's weaponry. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, well, <laughs> nice. Well, with that, that'll be the end of the video. So, uh, thank you all for watching this, uh, what is it called? Riptide Resurgence? Yeah, thank you all for watching this Riptide Resurgence video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.